Hi, I'm Stan. And I'm Rhonda. And we are Over the Hill Adventures. Welcome back. Today we are at Quartzsite, Arizona. We are at the Sports Vacation and RV Show in Quartzsite, Arizona. We took a day trip today from our hometown of Havasu and we, it took us about an hour and 20 minutes to get up here. It's pretty exciting. This, this town um, is a very small, small town here. It swells up to about 750,000 to a million people. There's a flea market, there is a rock and gem show that's supposed to take place. Uh, this particular show, the RV show, is taking place from the 16th of January, which today is the 20th, but only through the 24th, so that's only through Sunday. So we're trying to get this out and, you know, see if anybody's interested. You guys want to head this way and check it out. Um, we'll do our best to highlight some of the, there's some, supposed to be like over 150 vendors. Yeah, there's going to be about that. Um, and it's under a big tent. It's a rainy day today, so it's going to be kind of nice. Um, we're going to be inside, so it's going to be kind of cool. So let's go check it out. I'm ready to go. Right, I, I am too. All right, let's see you inside. Hey. Okay, first things first. This is a long drive. The best part of this is free. Masks are required, though. So we got our masks. And um, so that dogs are allowed, as long as you have them on a leash, too. So let's go see what we see. How you doing? Right, you got a YouTube channel? Yeah.
stealing the show. You're stealing the show. He's stealing the show. Something that you over the hill adventurers really need to look into. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. You can try it, so I'll show you. Tell us what tell us what that thing does, did you? <laughs> so it's a them. it's a percussion massage. So it's different than your shatsu rolling massaging. It's gonna go deep and it helps with muscle recovery, joint movement, increase circulation in the area, break up fascia buildup. Um, for quicker recovery. They use it a lot in sports medicine, chiropractors, physical therapists. This is a medical grade one. Uh, this one's my favorite for carving out the shoulder blades. If you get tension headaches, you use it on the base of your skull. It feels so yeah. good. Yeah. Try that out. Wow. Be careful not to, yeah. You want to let it just kind of glide right at the base, right there where you're kind of grabbing it down. A little air there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that feels great. An eyeball on these things. For so, a while. this comes with all so those great. attachments right there? Yep, you get all eight different attachments. And they all feel a little bit different, it will help for different areas. This one's nice for bonier, more sensitive areas. You can even use it on like your kneecaps. That's great. Uh, I got the one for the spine. This leg attachment yeah. everybody loves and I'm enjoys. Going back for this one. This is yeah. yeah. So, this is your main power switch on the bottom, okay. and you can turn it on right here. And then you got 20 oh. different speeds. You want to tell them what that what that's good for? Well, I get restless leg syndrome, so. Can you see it? That's pretty nice. That attachment just goes right here. Oh yeah. And it's my calves that it seems uh -huh. like it's where it. So really tight calves. It's just like oh my gosh. Yeah, to really increase circulation, break up fascia buildup. That's incredible. All right. Well, today. Uh, we're here with uh, Blue Ox. We've been talking to Jack here. And uh, as you guys well know in our video, we did the Track Pro on our half ton truck. And it's a good way to be able to display what we have here. Uh, this is the new Track Pro, came out in tw uh, 2020. And this is the Sway Pro. And what I did not know, and what Jack explained to me, was the fact that this one is actually holds a heavier tongue weight. The Sway Pro. And Jack, can you maybe uh, show us how that how that chain works? It looks really easy, folks. It's, uh, I was kind of surprised how easy it is. Just like that. And then he just drops the chain on. Just like that. Easy breezy. Easy breezy. Gets it in there. Nice leg. Nice link. There you go. Hey, this is a great product, you guys. Um, we're not affiliated, but a great product. So we just want to thank Jack here for showing that for us. And thank you, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> That's a cute little thing. I'm gonna get my grub on. <laughs> This is the 2970RL. It's 
It's got two slides. Comes in about 9,000 pounds. Wow. This is almost just like ours, except... Uh, except it's not. <laughs> it's not ours. Minus, minus. Oh, and that puts out some serious heat. That is really nice. TV, I like the position of the TV. Look at this pantry. Wow. Wow, look at that. Pretty nice. Not that we're already looking for something new, but it's just nice to be able to look and compare. I don't know about the potty, babe. Okay. No. Look, 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 look. <laughs> Well, it's not too bad, but I still ain't got enough See, room. See, that has... I don't have enough room. Yeah. You can't wear your jacket no. <laughs> sitting on the potty. Okay, that is nice, though. Very no, nice place. Very similar. Got the cubbies, got the drawers. Oh, look at that, though. Here, let's go. Nice wardrobe. A couple drawers there. Well, we didn't have the ability to tow something this heavy. How heavy? What's the gross vehicle weight? Oh, they said it was 9,000 pounds. Okay, yeah. All right. Well, what did you think? You know, I am glad that we did it. I'm glad that we came. It was a fun outing for sure. Um, I'm really cold, so that's not helping the matter at all. So that, you know, if you come on a warmer day, it is January, so you, you know, don't know what to expect. But regardless, I, I, I was, okay, highlight for me was going through the trailers. Uh, we got to see a lot of Imagines, a lot of Fifth Wheels, Solitudes. They had other brands, but we do tend to gravitate toward the grand design. So that was fun yeah. to get to, to get to do that. No sales pressure. You just go through them and at your own leisure. That was nice. Did you have so, a highlight? Yeah, I guess my review for what was going on in under the big tent was there's, there's a lot of stuff that was neat. A lot of stuff I'd like looking at, you know, like the, like the blue ox, uh, sway bar, the difference between that. And I, I enjoyed that part, but there's a lot of stuff under the big tent that really didn't, I felt didn't pertain to RVing RV. or anything yeah, like that. I agree. And I, I really didn't enjoy the sales pressure. That's just me being honest. Well, right um, off the bat, we walk in and, and DirecTV's right there and we like DirecTV. We don't have it, but I'm just saying we were right away hit and, and standing there for, you know, 10 minutes, 15 minutes talking to a guy from DirecTV. And, so I mean, nicest guy, nicest no, guy ever. Nicest hey, guy ever. <laughs> but uh -huh. it's just, you know, we didn't expect that. We were kind of had these 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 ideas of all RV and just oh wow, you know, and, and a lot of it, like you said, did not pertain to RVing. Um, uh, however, there were a lot of vendors there that, um, you know, for for more ride, uh, um, for for yeah, your suspensions some and yeah. some big names uh for that kind of stuff uh there was a lot of lithium batteries with solar i mean that that was that was pretty important so i thought we should show what we walked out of there with so there were some neat <laughs> i don't know can oh you... yeah okay so outside of the big tent <laughs> okay maybe there... we did like it more than uh, we <laughs> well if you go if you go to the oh. south Okay. Go to the south of the big tent. There was this one tent that had great deals of things you may need. For instance. Okay, so I'm gonna show. So, oh, just bring it up here. So we needed a trash can. Many different sizes to choose from. This thing was eight bucks. So it was a 16 by 20 and I, I'm pretty sure I can fit my kitchen size trash bags in it. I figured that's easy enough to uh, dump out every day. Dan got a kneeling foam kneel pad. And you know, use this whenever you need to kneel down. If you need to put a knee down and you're, and you're um, you know, pulling your waist or your gray water and you need to kneel down, that's 30 bucks. Yeah, that wasn't a bad deal. And it's what, uh, maybe inch thick. Looks like an inch thick, so that wasn't bad. And then for the, for the trailer, do you want to explain that? Yeah. Um, in in our where where your freshwater hookup 
it's it's I got an elbow and it just didn't work right and I saw um, on some of other YouTube videos that they were using this 45 degree angle one and we got that as you saw it seven bucks or whatever yeah so seven bucks not bad that, that was that you know just that in, in that tent we found a lot of great deals and then for our bedroom yeah vent. this this is for our because we don't have a fan in our vent so if we wanted to close that off during the winter or summer you know just to uh keep the cool in or to keep the heat in um that yeah. that just it's a vent insulator and you just throw it i was looking for that and that was only what 13 bucks, 13 or something bucks. Like that. yeah i think that was a really really yeah, good deal and it, was, and, it, and it was a good deal so there there are, and i'll tell you what there is that particular tent had everything in it that you you would want just about everything in it so yeah i had the mats for out front it had chairs it had um things for inside a lot of camco products it was kind of cool yeah it's, so it's like a swap meet like we said it, it's just kind of a big uh a big uh flea market lunch was great yeah i had smoked really brisket good. and they had that what is what oh, was those, that whole big old plate of the fries french fries we probably should have put that on video that was pretty incredible. No, well, no, I know we should have done yeah. that, but I was too busy eating it. However, Rhonda did. Uh, help. Um, oh, I did help him eat it, but what? But you no, know, you videotaped where it was at. And, yeah, and that's was, at, that was really. Uh, and that's good. on the east side. So it was definitely a nice outing. I am glad we did. I just was a little. I think the the low light for me was just that um, the sales. A lot of you know you're walking by, kind of like when you're in the mall and you walk by all those little kiosks and they're like hey you got a minute and they're trying to hand you products and bring cell you phone knickknacks that kind of know. stuff so was, there was a lot of that so if you do go be prepared for that and just uh you know we just would say um hey we just got here we just want to get a, a lay of the land and we'll be back <laughs> you know we you know didn't go back i think that's all we walked out with we almost did buy one of those percussion things um but i don't know i just I didn't want to spend actually it was a great deal it was half the price and plus then it was with the rainy weather they even discounted it more and you know we kind of almost really walked out with it and I, we just decided did we really need that right now and we decided not to but came really really close just one of those things that we do need it and we do want it but the question is do we need it now true so, yeah i didn't didn't but, uh we came in mind with i things for the trailer and and uh we left with things for the trailer, which is great. So, yeah, here's the yeah. tip for the day. Um, come midweek, mm. and if you can come on a rainy day, there's a lot less people here. Yeah, So a lot of it, puddles you have to dodge, but a lot less people. Yeah. yeah. And uh, so I think we covered everything. It was free. The parking was free. It was very accessible. They have bathrooms everywhere, like portal portal bathrooms everywhere. They have the, the sanitizing stations. Um, you do wear your masks inside and um, dogs are allowed on leash or in a stroller. So I have several in strollers and um, just, yeah, it was a great outing. I am glad we did it. Are you glad we did yeah, it? I'm glad we did it. I, I don't know if that We'll is do it, it again. Is it, on, is it on the fave list? No, I, I don't think so. Unless I need something yeah. really in particular that I thought yeah. that I could get here cheap. But other, or we want to come look at trailers because this was a very convenient way because they it, did have a lot. Of they had brands, every trailer too. under the sun. Yeah, I saw um, Cougars, Montana, um, every every so, things. Yeah. So anyway, and, and that gives you an opportunity to take a look at all of them. So yeah. Anyway. Um, Leave comments in the, uh, you know, down below if you guys have any questions that we may didn't, maybe didn't answer or um, uh, if you have any comments, we appreciate it. Please subscribe to our, our channel if you uh, like it and uh, give us a thumbs up. We'd appreciate it. And like Rhonda said, if you have any questions, um, yeah, We're I mean, here for you. there was just so much we really didn't see. You could actually, if you wanted to, um, walk couple days probably or yeah spend I mean, a couple of days if you want to depending on what you're looking for tools uh gems or rocks or whatever because they have that flea market at, um atmosphere here um a lot of those were closed because of the rain and i guess the tent mm. the big tent had a big power outage um because of the rain but other than that um it was festive uh saw a lot of stuff but um for for me not a fan probably won't come back again 
um, but you gotta at least try it, gotta at least check it out once. And there are more RVers here than you can shake a stick at. So anyway, yeah. yeah. This is Over the Hill Adventures out. Thanks for watching. Bye.